The District Department of Transportation recently activated the city's first bicycle traffic signal at the intersection of 16th U and New Hampshire Avenue. The goal of this pilot program is to help cyclists pass through the busy intersection safely without impacting other traffic. The bicycle intersection marks another step in D.C.'s push to become a more bike-friendly city. In a place like Washington, which is so urbanized now, um, and that's a good thing. Everybody loves the city, and part of the living in a city is finding common ground and using common facilities for the greater good. But more bikes on the road means more potential run-ins between motorists and cyclists. AAA is an organization that advocates for the rights and safety of motorists and travelers. There are rules of negotiating the road, and both parties, both the cyclists and the motorists, have to learn to share the road. But there has to be a common code of behavior so that we can anticipate what each other, because accidents occur in a split second. Experts say the key to better road sharing is education for both cyclists and drivers. Sometimes adults don't realize that when you're riding your bike on the street that you have to follow the same rules as cars. And by not following those same rules, you know, you open yourself up to a lot of potential accidents and conflicts. I, I think what we have to do is have strong, have a strong educational component to constantly remind motors, and not just in, in June when it's a bicycle safety month, but all year round. The Washington Area Bicyclist Association wants to help those interested in learning how to bike safely in an urban environment. It offers classes for cyclists of all ages and experience levels. We have a lot of adult ed classes that are free and they're sponsored by local governments. Oh yeah. We do something called Confident City Cycling Classes, and we've broken them up into three parts. Um, you know, everyone usually comes out of the class learning something, you know. Ultimately, the goal for almost everyone involved with the issue is the same, to create a more bike-friendly city while maintaining the safety of motorists, cyclists, and pedestrians. We have to become more civil in our driving and in our commuting. It's not a matter of who's wrong, but it's a matter of rights and the rights of everyone to use our transportation system. And that's what you have to keep in mind. Arissa Scalera, WAMU 88.5 News.